I tried to sell it on Niggas dying to beat me, so I'm living on Since they wanna pay attention, I'ma bail it on Just get it What up, guys? Um, I am about to head to Sherman Oaks That's where the surgery center is at Um, to get my nose done I'm getting rhinoplasty if you haven't already realized by this <laughs> But um, yeah, I'm on my way to Sherman Oaks right now. It's 6.25 a.m. And I have to be there by 7.30. So we are on the way now. And I will be showing you guys all the, as much as I can, honestly. I'm gonna let the nurses know that I'm vlogging so they can kind of help me. Because I know I'm gonna be out of it um, for the most part today. <laughs> but I'm gonna try my best to like vlog everything that I can. On me, not incisions, I'm sorry. Markings. He's going to, um, these purple marks are going to be where he's going to make the incision on, um, yeah, on my nose. So that's where he's cutting. And then, um, He's gonna go, everything's gonna be from the inside. So he's gonna make an incision here. And then he has to break my nose to make it straight. So I'm gonna just get this little hump down. So he has to go and do these little side pieces. And, uh, yeah, I should have recorded him talking, but I just was like so excited to see him. I didn't even think. But, um, hi! Okay, guys, I'm about to start. So. I will give you an update when I get out of here. Nice. So good. Hopefully you can see me. Let's see. Let me make sure this is right. Yeah, you can see me. Okay. What up, y'all? I got out of surgery like an hour ago. Mm -hmm. um, everything went good. Dr. Ashton came and talked to me and said everything was fine. Um, I'm kind of hurting right now. I'm more sleepy than anything. But um, everything went good. I tried to eat a cracker. All shit ain't happening, my mouth too fucking dry. So I'm choked on that shit. <laughs> Other than that, everything was good. I'll give you guys updated when I get home and how everything goes. But right now, I'm about to try to go to sleep. Look what my perra sent me. Thank you, perra. Look what she wrote. Can you see it? Is it focusing? Focus. <laughs> Fucking hate her. I I O S M. So I'm not really sure what happened to the audio, but right here basically was day two. I was about to go to sleep and my bruising was getting worse um, on both eyes. And um, yeah, so I didn't really have that much pain. Um, I was on my pain medicine, so I didn't really feel much. Okay, so this is day three. Um, I had woken up and I was super swollen. Um, so I basically iced almost that whole day. 
um, to try to help the swelling go down and I kept drinking my pineapple juice and eating normally and the pain was tolerable. So this next picture is from day four. I had just woken up. Um, the swelling had gone down. Uh, my bruising was still there, but it was getting more faint. This is day five. I had just woken up. The swelling, obviously, as you can see, has gone down like crazy. And the bruising as well. Like My bruising was going away so quickly. The pineapple juice really, really works. So if you have any injuries or bruises, um, I recommend drinking pineapple juice. I get these, I mean, this thing taking off me tomorrow. I'm so excited. Hi, Kiki! Lighting is. Oh, I didn't see that shit. Okay, so this is immediately after he removed my cast. Then he started removing my stitches. I'm not going to put that video up because it's so long. Um, but then right after this, this is how I looked immediately. My nose was still really swollen. And the pain of him removing my stitches literally was like the worst pain out of the whole thing altogether. But other than that, like I was happy with my results and how I was looking at the moment. And then this picture is from the night of when I got home from my cast removal. Um, I'm still swollen, still a little bit bruised, but it looks pretty good. Surgery. I just got out of the shower, so I look kind of crazy. But um, I it's been seven days, exactly a week since my surgery. It's now today's Friday, the 31st, and I got my nose done on the 24th. So it's been a week exactly from my rhinoplasty, and I am amazed at how great my bruising went away because look at my bruising it's like very minimal i just have this and this and then like on top of my eye and here it's like almost gone so pineapple juice you guys amazing that shit i was drinking i was juicing one pineapple like a full pineapple a day and drinking the whole thing that day like i was eating a pineapple a day for the past week I've been eating a pineapple day so and I've just been I juiced it and it would like I think it would give me like I don't know like a big I have a like those mason jars I was filling those up with the juice per pineapple so like it was giving me like a big mason jar full of juice and I would just drink it throughout the day whenever I wanted to like have some juice put it on ice and just drink it so I was having one of those a day that really helped with the bruising the bruising is like gone like you see a little bit of the yellow um and then here on this eye but like for the most part that shit is gone um and what else oh i had tape i went in two days ago on wednesday which was the fifth day well technically it was the sixth day um because i counted friday like the surgery day as day one so um i went in wednesday and he took my cast off and then he taped it so like when he taped it, he put three pieces of tape on my nose and it was really just for swelling. It wasn't really, it wasn't for like to hold my nose in place or anything. It was just for the swelling. So he told me to leave it on, but it was bothering the fuck out of me because it was getting, my nose was like getting crusty and like it's still kind of crusty because on Thursday night, I went and got a facial. The day before his surgery, I went and got a facial and i did like a four layer rejuvenating whatever like collagen facial thingy so they like you know it it's it, they take away some of your skin and it like usually it'll, it'll have your skin dry but i moisturized the hell out of my skin but i just couldn't because like everywhere else on my face is fine no peeling no thing but just my nose because i couldn't put any moisturizer or nothing on it it was getting crusty so the tape was bothering me so I just took it off just now <laughs> and took a shower I said fuck it and I just washed my face I washed my face normally did my full facial skin routine 
like normal and I was really gentle it was fine it's my nose is fine it doesn't hurt it just feels like um it's sore like if you have a bruise like that's what, how it feels so I was gonna retape it um I probably will maybe in a little bit I'm gonna google some shit and see if I need to retape it but if it was just for swelling like the swelling is going down anyways my nose it's usually my tip of my nose if you guys look at like previous pictures is very defined and like it's just a defined like pointy like nice pretty tip um it's swollen right now he didn't touch anything here like he didn't touch anything on my tip of my nose like all he did was um break my nose and make this straight because my septum was deviated it was like this like it was like so he had to take my septum out and i think he told me he took it out or he cut off a piece of it or some shit i can't remember exactly what he told me he did but he basically took like he broke my nose and took my septum out so i had to fix it because it it was like deviated so if he took it out my nose was gonna come back this way so that's what he told me he did and um yeah so everything's been good other than um I've been sleeping pretty normal now. Like, I don't... I sleep up... I mean, my, be my bed's a mess. I have laundry I need to fold. But I sleep up on those pillows right there. I put, like, two behind me. So I'm a little bit elevated, but not completely, like, sleeping how I was when I first got home from surgery. Like, I was sleeping like I was sitting in a chair like this. And I hated it. I couldn't even, like, relax. So that's how I've been sleeping. Not completely elevated, but, like, a little bit elevated. As long as your head is above your body, you, you should be fine. But, um, yeah, other than that, I just can't wait till my swelling is completely down. Um, so I can see how pretty, lo like, it looks. I already love it now. Like, I love the way it looks. There's, it's literally gone. Like, this is gone. That's all I wanted. It's gone. So I'm so happy with that. And, um, I want, I just want, like, the tip of my nose to come back to its pretty little. And, um, yeah, other than that, I'm good. I'm Gucci. Um i can't wait to work out again like i feel like a fat person because i just sit home and sleep and eat and don't do anything all day so i feel like i just need to get out the house like i've been trying to get out and do shit but like so when i go out people just look at me like i've been being on because i well before like two days ago when i was out people were looking at me like what the fuck happened to her but i'm gonna go out now because look i look fine i'm gonna put some makeup on that shit and be fine it's super Bowl weekend too so I'm gonna go watch the Super Bowl somewhere. Um, but yeah, other than that, I'm doing great, guys. Um, Dr. Ashton is amazing. He um, he really knows what he's doing, and I trust him with my whole life. Like if I get, ever get any surgery, ever, like I'm going to him for anything because he's really good. But um, yeah, so I just want to keep you guys updated on how I was looking, how I was feeling. This is how I look with no cast and no um, tape, nothing on it. Um, I, so far I love the results and I feel good. So I'll keep you guys updated. Oh, the camera straight? Hope it is. All right, so this is how I'm looking. It's been, tomorrow will be two, tomorrow will be two weeks since I've had my surgery on my nose. Um, oh. hi. Um, I have makeup on so you guys can't see but that my bruising and everything is gone um i'm still kind of like numb in like the tip of my nose and it's still swollen <clears throat> but everything else is like back down to normal um there's not really any pain like i think it's just kind of sore like right here around the bridge because that's where you have to like break my nose um to make this thing make this thing um straight so other than that um i feel like everything's pretty much back to normal um what else overall i'm happy with it um i'm more than happy with it i actually love it like i can turn to the side and not feel insecure anymore like i used to hate i used to always look at people like dead dead straight on or like all the way from the side because I just used to hate how, how crooked and like how much this will pop out but my nose still it's like it still looks pretty natural like 
nothing i don't know if you can see but like nothing really has changed on my nose if you look in from the front because i still have like i still have a deviation a little bit but i don't think anyone's face is like completely straight so mine definitely isn't but from the side the um the little hump is gone is and that was my biggest concern so it's gone now i'm happy and um overall the pain wasn't bad um Everyone keeps asking me, like, how oh, bad was the pain? Honestly, it wasn't that bad. I would do it again. Like, it wasn't anything that, like, hurt so bad I would never be able to go through again. Like, it wasn't that bad. So, um, yeah, the pain wasn't bad. And <sighs> Dr. Ashton, I will leave all his details down below on how you can contact him or get a consultation or whatever. He does a lot of different, um, excuse me, he does a lot of different, um, surgeries cosmetic surgeries um he does a great boob job he does bbls he does everything everything a surgeon plastic surgeon could do he can do um so i'll leave all his details below for you guys um other than that i just wanted to make this last video to show you guys how i'm looking now that my bruising and everything's gone i'm kind of almost back to normal i just wanted to show you guys this side profile yeah so like comment subscribe um this is my first video going up so i'm gonna try to get into this youtube thing and post videos for you guys like twice as much as i can because i i consider my snapchat and my instagram story and my vlogging and if i can just put it into a youtube channel it would be way better so yeah Tune in, guys. There'll be more.